Equalizer relief pitcher Tony Smith. Tony, tell us about your background, where you started from, how you started playing, and how you ended up here. Uh, well, I'm from a small town in Southern California called Twenty Nine Palms, and uh, kind of grew up there. And my mom got me into playing baseball when I was young, and then uh, went to school in Eastern New Mexico, a little small Division Two out there. And after that, I decided I wasn't done playing, so I went to Australia for a little bit, and then uh, came back over here, started playing in the Pecos League for a few years, which I wouldn't wish that on my worst enemy. And uh, and then I ended up coming out here, and, and Rick's given me a good opportunity, so it's a fun time out here. This has been a lot more fun than the Pecos League. Oh, definitely, yeah. The Pecos League, I uh, I ended up spending a lot more money than I made there, you know. And uh, But, I mean, it was, good. it was a good opportunity to get out and get my name out there, and it got me here, so it can't be, can't be too bad. Um, what made you decide to go to the Pecos League and maybe explain to people what it's play, like playing in that league? Oh, it's definitely uh, it's, de- <laughs> it's definitely a... Uh, 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 kind of last resort for people who just want to get out there and play again. But like I said, you know, uh, the, the competition is really, really well out there. You know, it's really good competition. And uh, uh, <clears throat> as long as you keep playing well and you get your name out there, then you can do <laughs> you kind of do what you got to do. That's Luis Allen for everybody who's <laughs> watching. Luis, congratulations. Um, but so, so you got – and now here comes Highland Figueroa. <laughs> Anyway, so Tony, you got yourself here. Tell us why this is so much different than the Pecos League. Well, you know, it's different than the fact that, I mean, we have charter buses, we stay at good hotels, you know. Uh, the competition's obviously double A quality, so we get a lot of ex big leaguers like Highland Pagero right there. He was an ex big leaguer for a couple months, you know. It's, a, it's just a, it's a higher level of competition here, so it's good for when scouts come out and see you that they kind of just throw you right into the mix and get you quicker to the to the big leagues as quick as you can. You're not here to learn so much as you're here to win. Do you like that kind of atmosphere? Definitely, definitely. I mean, we all kind of learn from each other, like especially Pagero and kind of the vets kind of take us under their wing, especially as being a rookie like I am. Uh, they take us under our wing and uh, and kind of teach us the ways of, of professional baseball, and it's, uh, it's a good thing. You know, it's good that they can show us how to – kind of carry ourselves like professionals and then we kind of take it out there on the field and just try to try to put up some wins. How's it been for you facing teams and players you've probably never seen before? I mean we uh <clears throat> Verm is Verm is a, is a great pitching coach you know I've, I've read a lot about him before I came here and everything like that and we do pitchers meetings before every series so I mean I kind of learned the tendencies of the hitters and stuff like that and and so I mean it's I don't know them personally, but I kind of know what they like and what they don't like at the at the plate. So it kind of helps me out. Uh, for your first year in, in this league, are you pleased with your performance to date? Uh, thus far, absolutely. You know, I mean, I can definitely uh, stop walking people so much. I mean, I, I'm almost uh, to my whole last season's walk total. So, uh, but I mean, I, I definitely enjoy it. I have a lot. Is it a tougher time. strike zone here? Definitely. I, I wouldn't say a tougher strike zone, but I would say more patient hitters. Like, they don't really chase a lot as, as they do in other leagues, you know, like in the Frontier League, kind of got guys, guys fresh out of college who like to chase balls that you keep down and stuff like that. And here's a lot more patient. So, I mean, just keep pounding the strike zone, and hopefully they hit it somewhere, one of our guys. Have some fun. Oh, definitely. That's all I've been doing.